It's a pleasure to have you join me with tonight's weather report. I'm Marlene Kenyana. Now, if you're heading back to work tomorrow, you'll need to check on the forecast, which will come in just a bit. First, let's look at how it has been for today. We've seen clear skies over Uganda, indicating sunny conditions, which have been also mixed with haze, especially in morning hours. Now, this has been a result of the high pressure center in the north of Africa that is pushing dry winds and also sun particles from Sahara Desert towards our region, which is why we're having haze and dry conditions. And we still have a problem of the low pressure zone over the Indian Ocean that is taking away the moisture which would have been coming to our country and because of this we're having reduced wet weather activities. Now when you wake up tomorrow morning it's going to be bright and sunny and hazy for most parts of the country and it could feel very cold early in the morning so you need to be very conscious out there so you could feel like it's worth out of the door. But later in the afternoon it's going to be pretty sunny for much of Uganda though along the Lake Victoria Basin we could see a mix of clouds and sunshine. Now also temperatures are likely to rise up to 34 degrees centigrade for the Karamoja region. Quite sizzling for Kampala and temperatures will go up to 28 degrees centigrade though along southwestern Uganda we are likely to have temperatures rising up to 25 degrees centigrade. Now let me take you through some of the cities selected across Africa where we're seeing that Luanda and Antananarivo are likely to have thunder showers, light showers for Kigali and Djibouti and most other cities within the continent are likely to be sunny though we're forecasting cloudy conditions for Algiers and Dhaka. Now, a much vision takes us to some of the cities selected across the world. We are seeing cloudy conditions in Dubai and temperatures rising up to 23 degrees centigrade during the afternoon. Now, for Washington and London, they're likely to have heavy showers and Moscow is still having falling snow with temperatures going below zero during the night. Now, during this dry condition, you should be aware of airborne diseases like flu and cough that could erupt because of the dry and hazy conditions. Thank you for giving me company and also stay with us.